All right, thanks, Tim. Your voice, your vote. The Shelby County primary election is less than two weeks away, and there are five Democrats in the race for General Sessions court clerk, and also there is there are two Republicans. One of those says he's been in and out of the courts for 24 years. In her profile of a candidate, Stephanie Spurlock talks to James Jim Finney, a candidate running on the Republican side. James Finney has been in and out of Shelby County Courts for two decades, working as a process server. Now he wants to take on the job of Shelby County General Sessions Court Clerk. Of all the time I've had in, in the court, I know that, uh, that uh, now is the time to, to make a change in the court. The 25-year retired Navy man came to Memphis in 1977 and retired here. He's seen court clerks come and go. The current clerk is suspended while he answers official misconduct charges. First of all, I want to look at morale. Morale is very, very important. For the people who use the office, this is what he plans. I've spoken with a lot of attorneys, and their, one of their biggest complaints is that the computer system is not user-friendly. Well, if, if, if I'm able to be elected, we're going to change that. Fenny says he also wants to work with the folks in Nashville to start a small claims court in Shelby County to deal with claims $5,000 or less. He also says he'll use his radio talk show on KWAM 990 to air out the people's problems. If you have a problem... With, the, with General Sessions Court, it's live, you can call me. And when you call me, that's the same thing everybody else in, in, the, in all of Shelby County is hearing this conversation. And it's open door. Finney says some of the changes needed in the clerk's office are simple, and he'll draw on his daily experience to make them happen. If there's a poster child of leadership and integrity, I'm, I'm the one that, that, that's been there. Stephanie Skirlock, WREG News, Channel 3. An early voting in the Shelby County primary begins February 15th to see all of the profiles of the candidates running in both the Republican and Democratic General Sessions court clerk's race. You can go to WREG.com and click on your voice, your vote.